You ever notice how women get blamed for everything that men do? Right? Like a man will cheat on his wife and instead of holding him accountable for his actions, they'll be like, well, why was his wife not doing her wifely duties that he felt like he needed to step out? Or like a woman will get assaulted and they'll be like, what was she wearing? Why, how much did she have to drink? Why was she there? Or like some psycho will commit a mass shooting against everybody and in his manifesto he'll be like, girls were mean to me and they wouldn't talk to me. And then they'll be like, well, if women had just shown him some attention and he wouldn't have been so angry. Or they'll blame the mother. Ugh, that one's rich. Did you know that most violent offenders are raised by single mothers? Like just completely gloss over the fact that the father wasn't even around, that he actually made the choice to leave and not raise his own child, but we blame the parent that stayed. It's just it's just amazing to me. Like, name a thing a man does and I guarantee you women get blamed for it somehow. Cue the triggered men in my comments, but I'm not a woman, but if I was a woman, I'm not opening my door. I'm not paying at a restaurant. I'm not choosing where to go eat. I'm not making the plans for the evening. If I was a woman, I would demand, demand that I be treated like a queen to be honored, respected, cherished, and valued. I would demand it because my standards would be so high for my life that the only man that could possibly ever think of being with me is a man that is fully in his masculine. And that's when you stop attracting little boys and you start attracting real men is when you decide that you're worth it. No man should ever control a woman. A man that tries to control a woman and tell her what to do, where to go, and who to go with is a man that is deeply insecure secure and is deeply in dark energy. Love doesn't control. It doesn't restrict. It just lets everything flow. So when a woman is being controlled, that's not love. That's fear. The woman has to ask herself, what inside of me caused me to attract that kind of man? If you don't take personal responsibility for what happens in your life, then you're always a victim and you start to blame the man, which don't get me wrong in this situation. Yeah, the man is to blame. Yet, what did I do to open myself up or to maybe not see the signs and not pay attention to my intuition and my power when I first saw the signs that didn't have the courage to say this needs to end now. And that's where one can truly grow. Women, guard your energy. Mm -hmm. Men are being taught to only value you for your bodies. Yeah. They're being taught to pursue you for your bodies. They have forgotten to pursue you for your heart, for your intellect, for your intuition, for your inner strength, mm -hmm. because society has programmed them this way. So when they keep pursuing you and pursuing you, you have to understand that most of the time they're pursuing you only for your bodies. You can feel it when they're pursuing you for your heart because they'll be patient with you. They will honor you. They will hold space for you. And the worst thing that you as a woman could do is to give them your body right away because they got what they wanted and that's it. They're mm -hmm. on to the next one. You're never going to find true love that way. You have to honor yourself and wait. Wait till that moment feels like it's just, it, there's no more thinking. There's, it just falls into place beautifully. And even then, even then, wait a little more.